before the, the pandemic, we had about 700 billionaires in America. There are 1,000 billionaires now. You know what their average tax rate is? 8%. Raise your hand if you want to trade your tax rate now for 8%. <laughs> no, I'm not joking. I, I'm not being deadly earnest. You know, it sounds like I'm making this up. 8% what they pay. That's why I proposed the billionaire minimum tax of 25%. That's not even the top rate. If billionaires and big corporations paid even close to their fair share, we could strengthen Social Security and Medicare, bring down the cost of child care, elder care, working class, middle class people would all be better off, and it wouldn't cost a penny because they make $40 billion would be come into them. And it's not, I mean, it's just, it's just basic fairness. You know, it's the right thing to do, and we can get this done. And I'll be damned in the last year of this administration, I'm going to get it done. Yeah. Let me close with this. I'm going on too long. I probably get a little tied up here. This bridge is important, but the story we're writing is much bigger than that. When you see the shovels in the ground and cranes in the sky and people hard at work in these projects, I hope you feel a re renewed sense of pride. Pride in your community. Pride in what we can do. Pride in America. Pride knowing we can get big things done still together in America. We're the only country in the world that's come out of every crisis we've gotten into stronger than we went in. Not a joke. The only country in the world. For God's sake, this is the United States of America. The United States of America. And the real heroes in this whole story, the American people are starting to speak up. American workers, American people doing the work to bring communities back to the country in ways that are there was before in the future. That's what America does. That's why I've been never more optimistic about the future. We just to remember who in God's name are we're the United States of America. And there's nothing, nothing beyond our capacity when we do it together. Let's start working together for God's sake. God bless you all. May God bless you.